Welcome Sizzlers to another episode of Lily Sizzling on Sizzletastic.tv coming to you from the Tampa Bay and YouTube land. So come check us out on Sizzletastic.tv. Bon appetit y'all. to another episode of Lily Sizzling and this fall we are going to be cooking up a Philly cheesesteak sandwich that will be sure to please any ghoul, any girl, any boy. I don't know, we're going to keep having to rhyme. <laughs> we're not Dr. Seuss up in here, remember the other <laughs> episode where we were trying to do the yeti and spaghetti. So anyways, come watch me cook my meat. So we got this spectacular meat here. I'm spanking it. Spank your meat. Rock's heart, do we gotta spank our meat before we cook it? Oh yeah, woo! Gotta spank our meat. So anyways, we're gonna get our meat cut up here into little chunks. Don't ask me. <laughs> don't ask. <laughs> I don't know what impression I just did. Uh, I don't know what you just did. <laughs> I think it was a wolf like or something. Off. He's dressed like a wolf. I'll have to show him to you. We're going to cut the meat up into little chunks here. We're going to put it into our frying pan and we're going to sizzle it on up. And this will be put onto our steak sandwiches and we're going to get it all nice and seasoned. So you can see what I'm doing. I'm just cutting my meat. It's kind of a spooky, gory episode. I'm cutting my dead cow. Mm. It's coming back from the dead to sizzle for you sizzlers. Yeah, add some olive oil up in there. So start sizzling ding, ding. on the next episode of Lily Sizzling on sizzletastic.tv or else, or else I'll come get you in your dreams. All right, so we're gonna season our meat here, our cauldron of entrails. <laughs> a little bit of season, uh, it's a little bit of salt, a little bit of garlic, lots of fresh cracked pepper. Oh yeah, pepper! Secret ingredient. Right? It's peppery steak meat. Not that. Oh. It's liquid smoke. Liquid smoke. Everybody has pepper. <laughs> Everyone adds pepper. How I make my steak sandwiches, I add liquid smoke. And I just kind of let it all come in there. Oh, you can smell it. Oh. Oh, if that doesn't smell like fall and burning stuff, get back in there. There'll no be no escape. escape. There'll be no escape from this pot. No Michael Schofield's here. And there we have it. There's <laughs> our meat. We're going to leave him on a low here. Kind of let him come up here with all these beautiful seasonings in there. That'll be our uh, meat there for our Sizzletastic Philly sandwich. And it will be sure to feed any crowd because I've got to show you the bread that we're gonna be using next. And the bread alone is scary. All right, so we're gonna get our vegetables ready. We're gonna keep coming back to you. Watch her, I'm gonna get you and attack you. What are you doing, cameraman? So we're gonna come back over to the cauldron. And we're going to add in some oil. Turn up our flame. Add in some mushrooms. Get in there. And now we're going to chop these peppers up and take out all their seeds so they can no longer reproduce. Isn't that mean and evil of me? We're going to chop them up and we're going to put these peppers into our brewing stewing cauldron to make our big party Philly cheesesteak sandwich that everyone will enjoy for any celebration. It will be a sure hit. 
I give you the spell of success when you make this. And a full, sizzle-tastic, happy belly. All right. So we're going to add in three bell peppers because it is a very big sandwich. Now there's a count to it, a one and a two and a three. <laughs> what? The count like the Dracula guy on Sesame Street there. I don't know. One, uh, 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 two peppers, uh, 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 three peppers, uh, 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 uh. Roxas that guy? Are, yes, Rox is our voice imitation guy. I don't know what you're talking about. He can do all the types of weird voices. No, well, I think you mean the count from Sesame Street, hmm? No, I mean Yoda. I was doing Kermit. Oh, okay, sorry. The other Sesame Street guy. I thought you were doing Yoda. Wrong, wrong. Don't that... stick to cooking your stick. Is that good or Kermit? <laughs> I don't know. I didn't say I was good at this impression You're... stuff. You're doing a good job. You're doing better than I can do. I can't do any voices. Just some voices. Oh, give me some head. cookies. Yeah? Oh, there's no cookies in this meal. Oh, no, that there makes is... Cookie Monster very sad. Yep. There is a monster. Where's there, the right? cookies? No. Here, have a bell pepper. Nom 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 nom. Right? <laughs> and one onion. Is, is it an onion juice. cookie? Uh, yeah, right. I haven't even touched the wine yet. <laughs> <laughs> no, you have not. And you're already entertaining us. Thank you, Rox. So we're going to take one onion here and add it to our cauldron spell. Oh, that liquid smoke and steak, and now you can start smelling the peppers. It's smelling spooky-tastic and sizzle-tastic. There we go. Get this onion. Chop it up. Chop, 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 chop. Ah, spooky onion. Yes, yes. More. Adam and onions. Enhance my spell. I am. I don't know More what of your I'm spell. Doing. The Emperor Palpatine? Yeah, right? Kaden can do that one. Cross over to the dark side. It is your destiny. <laughs> I told you, folks. The cameraman, <laughs> he's so silent all the time, but he's really kooky and crazy. You should be up here doing this in different character voices. You'd be more entertaining than me peeling garlic. I'm serious. <laughs> I got nothing else. I'm trying. I'm digging. I only have like four characters. Yeah. Uh, uh -huh. Yeah. I've just seen you do like five <laughs> different voices. You can keep going with it. You're just being shy. <laughs> Take our hand. Smell. Smash. 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 Smash it. Smash I'm using the proper tool for the job. Is that the proper tool? I don't know. I don't even know. I, I have no clue. <laughs> In with the garlic. We're professionals here. Lots of garlic. Hey, but you should totally smash that. There will be no vampires visiting your house this fall with all this garlic. Oh, God. He was just doing he was in my head. <laughs> I was going to talk. Go ahead. Do it. No. Do it. Well, now I got to do a vampire. Okay, do a vampire. I want to suck your blood. <laughs> oh, now you're Dumbass. Oh, my God. Rock's hard. You could be a voice actor. Could be. Or am I? Yeah, you are behind my camera. All right. So there we have it. We have our garlic and all of our good vegetable-y stuff here that's going to go on our sandwich. And it is just sizzling on up in here. We're going to add the steak in once the steak gets done and kind of combine all this spooky potion of great vegetable gooey goodness together.
Oh yeah. It smells sizzle tastic. It does. It does smell sizzle tastic. And we're gonna add in a little bit of pepper. We're just sea salt in there. And we're gonna let this come to and cook on down together. Meanwhile, this is coming together beautifully. Look at that smoke, folks. Oh, yeah. Mm. Oh, it smells good. Oh, it's making my stomach growl. It's growling. It wants to eat the meat. Oh, I'm summoning a big bad wolf here. Yeah. Okay, oh. I've had enough. <laughs> I've had enough. Okay, big bad wolf. Oh, I want to huff. I want to puff. And I want to blow your house down and eat all your steak sandwiches. Do another one. What other one? Another voice. What other voice? You're doing a bunch of other voices. What, the wolf? I uh, know you were doing a bunch of other ones on camera just a few seconds ago. I don't know what you're talking about. You're just doing like in my head and uh, Cookie Monster and Kermit and Emperor Palpatine and... Do the Emperor Palpatine to the to the vegetables. Fry them. Sizzle them. Is this your mixer? Yeah. Stir. Mm, yes, yes. Feel my power. Oh, do not resist your destiny. <laughs> you make a better character on the show than I do. There you go. All right, we should do that. Cooking with Roxas Different Personalities. A new a new TV show. It's probably spoiling the name. Not, not enough material for like a whole episode. You know? uh, yeah, 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 right. Says so the guy dressed up in a wolf head doing a bunch of different voices. Sizzletastic.tv. Sizzletastic.tv. Subscribe. Yes. Button here. I did your silly thing. You gotta try some of my wine. I don't wanna do this. It tastes uh, so bad. It's pretty good, actually. It's one of the most flavorful wines I've I'm had today. I'm already to gagging. Give me a taste of random junk. What is that kind of sissy sip? No, oh, it's not that bad. Take a real gulp. Yo. They hit you on the back of the throat. Tastes tasty. No, it's not tasty. tasty. No. It's called Ozv. I don't know what it's called. Ozv. Ozzy. Ozzy. He's yeah. drinking Ozzy wine. Show it. You should try some of this wine. It's pretty good. You can do Ozzy Osbourne's voice. Oh my god. He just like. Where did I put the uh, me cup of tea? Oh, are you okay. Jack Sparrow? Yeah, I kind of missed it. I know, right? You're like going back and forth here. You're drinking too much wine in my kitchen. You're a bad cameraman. There's not even wine oh. in this episode. It's tasty. Oh, isn't it? Well, it can be. Yeah, it all there is now. You drank it. Oh, it's all gone now. Yeah. Where'd me rum go? Where's me rum? There you go. <laughs> You're drunk. I am not. I can recite the alphabet backwards. Yeah, try it. Z, Y, X, W. <laughs> She's wasted. I can't do the alphabet backwards sober. You're How do you expect so someone drunk. who's drunk to even like go we're gonna Z, score. Y, X? But we're going to score. Got this chick drunk. This is spooky, scary. I'm going to totally do her first dumbass. <laughs> so our meat, I think, is done. I'm going to bite my meat. Ow! Mm. Ah. That's terrible. Mmm. I'm biting my meat. That's some good sizzletastic meat right there. So sizzletastic.tv. We're going to add this meat on into these veggies and we're going to cook it all up together. Let all those uh, flavors incorporate. And we're going to start uh, stuffing up our bread. We got bread that's like six feet long coming up to you next. Don't talk with your mouth full. Dirty cauldron up with me bread. Look how big this bread is. It's this taller is than like, you are. It is. <laughs> oh my goodness. Want to break bread with me? Here. Wouldn't I be mighty then? Rawr. Right in 
my broomstick. Here, I'm riding my red broomstick around the room. I gave her too much wine. She drunk. No, I'm not. Here, break it with me. Break my bread. Break it. Break it. We gotta break it. In gotta half. cut it, you fool. I can't cook it in the oven like this. Break it. Tug of war. Larger half wins. Gets a yeah. wish. Yeah. Longest half gets. Oh. <laughs> I get the <sighs> wish. I get the wish. Uh. You saw it here, folks. I get the wish. He lost. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know. I repaired this thing so long. <laughs> I said long. <laughs> he said long. This episode is just way too silly. Wow, that's a big piece of bread. I have to cut it again because it's not going to fit in my oven at that way. Totally glad she, her judgment of what is big is what it is. Yeah, this is big. <laughs> Makes this me feel better. This is tiny. This is big. I'm gonna separate our bread ever so carefully, folks. And we're gonna start stuffing it with cheese. Don't be stingy. Oh, I won't be. About three pieces. Is that all the right cheese? There. Yes. What do you this want? This is a steak em sandwich, yo. Well, I'm gonna have to go get some more cheese out. Yes, that's the idea. Oh, did you bite my cheese? <laughs> no. He bit my <laughs> no, cheese. I did not. He's eating my cheese. He's like a little rat. Ratatouille up in here. <laughs> I'm going to need some more cheese. Why don't you like to think of... Can you become a cow so I can milk you and make some cheese? Mommy, I'm... Okay, let's get some more cheese up here on our bread. Uh... That look good, is, that rocks. Is, is that all? Is that all you're gonna put on there? What, what do you want? Hear ye, hear ye, don't be stingy. I'm not using the rest of this. No, uh, here, here. Yes, yes you are. Yes, make a cheese glob. I'll make a cheese glob on bread. That's my wish. <laughs> yes, yes cheesy, cheesy goodness. You'll eat this and put like five pieces of cheese on it and bake it? Oh yeah, I'll eat that on, on an episode. Camera. That'd be sick. Blah. Heart attack. You would eat that? It's Seriously? Kind of, I would like, eat that. It's a cheese sandwich. Yes, a cheese gobby sandwich. Okay, you better eat this. <laughs> Edit. Look at that, folks. Woo, that Steaming. looks... Steaming. Like we need more meat and potatoes and stuff. Just turn this into a stew. Look at that. Oh yeah. That's about well, ready to be done. Sizzle-tastic is what it smells like. What were you about ready to say? Uh, he was going to cuss. I, I, I was not. He was going to say the F word. I was not. I was going to say that's freaking awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're going to cuss. You know it? You bad person, you. Kooky <laughs> 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 right. crisp. There he goes again, <laughs> folks. More characters. Okay, so we're going to get this meat up into our bread, and we're going to start baking in the oven for a few minutes to let that cheese melt together while our other cheese glob is melting. Please don't hurt me. So I'm going to get out a cookie tray. <laughs> I'm feed me, Seymour. Feed me. I'm going to get out a cookie tray while he's over here doing crazy impressions. He's a big and, and bad. We're gonna mean get and green. You're making me hiss at you. I'm hissing at you. You dog. I'm a cat. You are a nasty dog. Okay, so we're going to get out our baking tray and we're going. Excuse me! <laughs> so I'm going to get out our baking tray. Oh, screw it. I'm just going to get out our baking tray and you're going to watch. Here. And we're going to. Stuff our bread full of steak and vegetables and all that gooey, gooey goodness. It's close to midnight. Oh, yeah. Something's out there looking in the dark. 
Oh my goodness, look at this. This is sizzle tastic. This is everything. This will be sure to please any spooky Halloween guests who come over. Any fall travelers. Heck, any time of year you can make this, but what really gets to me is the beautiful fall colors that I picked in those bell peppers. So if you want to really make it look like a fiery fall, you get those nice beautiful orange and yellow and red. Oh yeah. Look at that. Now that is some steak. That is how you make Philly steak sandwiches. Wild Bills in Sacramento eat your heart out because you still can never make a better sizzle tastic steak sandwich and then Lily is sizzling. You just make grease and salt. We had a Yelp battle like many years ago. Like, and then his, his like steak sandwich shop like went under or something. Stupid person. All right. <laughs> he was like, he made like these like really salty, greasy steak sandwiches and dared to call them a steak sandwich. I was like, what is this junk? Ain't no steak sandwich. And you told me, like, I could never make a better steak sandwich than him. And I've showed him up, like, plenty of times. Like, he can't make a steak sandwich like that. I told him, I said, your steak sandwich, you can't even see the vegetables. At least in mine, you can see the vegetables. Look at those mother uh, vegetables. Yeah, eat your heart out, Wild Bill. <laughs> Woo! All right, so I'm going to take out your cheese bomb here. I'm going to feed it to you. Ugh. Woo, I'm vegetable. ready to eat my cheese bomb. Are you ready to eat your cheese bomb? I don't know. Bill? I'm getting kind of nervous, actually. You're, you're nervous. I'm a little nervous. Look. It's like a cheese glob. <laughs> <laughs> what am I up to? You want some cheese? It's still sizzling. Hell yeah, sizzle-tastic. Yeah. Sizzle-tastic cheese glob there. I'm going to take some stills of your cheese glob sandwich. <laughs> okay, now you said you would do it. You I would You said you would eat this cheese glob. Let's see you put your money where your mouth is. So I'm going to just make a little special thing here with the fat. So remember those strips of fat? I'm going to kind of sizzle these up here. Ow! Oil them, yay! <laughs> well, you watch out. This is the end of the show. So I'm going to sizzle up this fat here, and this is great for animal food. I have my kitty cat right here. She's been watching the whole episode. She's just asleep now. And, um, my kitty cat and my dog. They like to eat my steak, so I like to give them my little pieces of steak here and I fry them up for them. Nice and good there. And saute them in some olive oil and they love it. It's perfect for them. Perfect for the medium cat. Perfect. Okay. Meanwhile, our steak sandwiches. Ooh, this is so fantastic. Yep, we have a couple more minutes left on those. Meanwhile, Rox is going to eat his steak or his <laughs> cheese cloth. No, okay, we're Rox, not. Get it over. Oh, boy. Okay, Rox, the moment of truth. Will he eat a cheese glob on cheese bread? Glob sandwich going down. You said you wanted more cheese. Uh. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's cheesy. Is it good? All that cheese? It's globby. Another bite? Yeah. He likes it. Another bite? If he didn't like it, he wouldn't be asking if he could take another bite. So cheesy. Mmm. That was a good bite. He a would. He would cheese like cheese that. He, he likes cheese wow. upon cheese upon cheese. Mm. You weirdo. You can almost taste the steak. Almost, yeah. Like the overbearingness of cheese. Is it sizzle tastic? Mm, Don't eat it with your mouth full, dog. Uh. Ugh. Ew. Let it go. Now we know how you got this. <laughs> <laughs> Ew. Gross! He's making me sick. Um, it's so cheesy. He's in oh. cheese heaven. No, no, I'm not gonna do <laughs> it. it. No. Tasty. Come on, dog. It looks tasty. Oh, I'm ready for some. Give me some. Oh, look, that piece right there looks. Oh, yummy. Don't yummy, touch yummy. it. You'll burn yourself. 
So let your food cool, and this is a great little treat that you can do with your fat Trick or your treat dogs and for the cats. dogs. Great, they love it. Trust me, they do. All right, and this is a moment of truth. This is our steak sandwich. Whoa, look at that powerhouse sandwich. sandwich. We're gonna serve this guy up here, and we're gonna cut him up, and we're gonna eat him. So let's get started with that. Coming up to you next. Okay, hey, just fold it over like so and cut into it. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is crazy. Oh. Wow. It's like a monster steak I'll touch in. it. Oh, yeah, I want some. Look at that cheesy, oh, that look cheesy look at that globby cheesy. milk. Oh, oh, uh, oh, look at it. Look at it. Dibs, 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 dibs. And that, folks, this, folks, is how you cook a steak sandwich. This is a steak sandwich to die for. Yeah, it's a monstrous steak sandwich here for your sizzle-tastic, spook-tastic fall Halloween episode here on Lily's Sizzling. And Kitty Cat here cooked up some steak here, and I sizzled it on up with all those bell peppers and onions. It was ghoulishly spectacular. Look at that. Look at that. Yes, you can see the vegetables, the beautiful fall color. Reminds you of the fall color of the Quit leaves. Quit moving. <laughs> I get a picture. It's so beautiful. Isn't that beautiful, folks? Eat your heart out. The steak sandwich here at Lily's Sizzling, sizzletastic.tv. And until next time, bon appetit. Keep it sizzling, little sizzlers out in sizzletastic land. Sizzle, sizzle, sizzle. <laughs>